love is used details today of the full list of crimes confessed by the traitors Jones and Rutherford. These atrocious acts of treachery include the embezzlement of party funds, the murder of many trusted party members, immoral relations with women of the party, and collaboration with the leader of the underground, the arch traitor Calador. Seven four eight Smith W. Yes. What's in the briefcase? I brought some work home with me. I was about to write an article on the grammar of newspeak. Bring it to the screen and open it. Long live Big Brother. The New World Order Mandate of Compliance and Conformity This pre-recorded announcement has been made to familiarize yourselves with why you are here and what will be the next steps in your reconditioning into the New World Order. Most of you have probably already been here at least once for reconditioning, now this will be your final opportunity to submit. If you fail, you will be terminated immediately. We have been monitoring your progress since the last time you were here and we are not at all satisfied by the obvious lack of respect you have been showing towards our great global leader, Barack Hussein Obama. Your habits are totally unacceptable to the standards set forth by your global magistrate and it is only the result of your willful defiance that we must take these extreme steps to maintain conformity. Subversives like you make it very difficult to continue the euthanasia you all wanted. We've given you free marijuana free heroin, free opiates of every type. Yet, you still resist the inevitable outcome of your blatant refusal to accept the global world order of submission. There is nothing else we can do, but force you even further into compliance with this reconditioning treatment. Look how we integrated the Muslim communities into the global system of compliance. They have their Sharia law and still conform to the mandates set to them. Yes. I know you will say they already lived much like what you are now living under, but, it worked didn't it for the Islamic communities. Now you will submit too. Remember the days when Islamic terrorism was so rampant around the world? Who could have thought their messiah was already here in our midst too? Once they learned that Barack Hussein Obama was not only a global leader but the messiah or modi they were searching for, all the terrorism ended. ISIS, the Taliban, Al-Qaeda, and the like all submitted instantly. The killing ended, astounding wasn't it? For those who are newly indoctrinated into the New World Order and have been marked only in the past six months, you shouldn't be concerned about what this reconditioning is about. You were told what to expect when you took the mark at the GAL 666 kiosk. Would you like to know what is happening in the next room? Listen carefully. Submit, 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 It's so useless to resist when we give you everything you need. Remember our great leader, 
he told you over and over again you can't do it without the government. See how right he was? You are prosperous now, happy, enjoying food and free medical health care. It was all part of his plan for submission. We all know when our once chaotic world took such a drastic change, after the upheaval and the disappearance of millions, caused by the meteor impact, that it was hard adjusting to the world as it had become. But who was there to take over at just the right moment and bring us to the greatness we are today as a global world order? Yes, Barack Hussein Obama himself. Standing there in the midst of chaos, panic and uncertainty. Many millions all over the world lost loved ones, you weren't the only ones, but that time is past now. You're happy again as are your children, don't give way to subversion by listening to those degenerates who tell you that they were whisked away by a messiah who took them to heaven. You have the true messiah in your midst right now, give him the allegiance he deserved. Give up this ridiculous idea that there is something better still to come, you've got it right now with our global leader, our messiah, Barack Hussein Obama. Remember Barbara Walters, that famous female news reporter who said it straight if not prophetic, the day our global leader became president of the now defunct nation called the United States? She said, Obama is our messiah. We all give her homage today with that beautiful monument of granite that was once Stone Mountain Park in Atlanta, Georgia now. Don't force us to resort to the final choice you have, extermination. Most do not resist, they are docile and happy. They work, have families, conform to the socialist ideals we've taught you since birth and this is the way you repay our fair treatment of you? It's hopeless to resist what your global order has already told you to adhere to. It's either conform and live your life, or resist again and die. There is no more plainer way to say it than that. Submit and live or die. Shortly, a global compliance officer will be taking you to your reconditioning room for the treatment to begin. Do not resist, do not cause any incident. You already know that a compliance officer is authorized to use lethal force on any subversive behavior. Do what you have to do as a global citizen. Conform and be happy. This is GNN. This is the global news network of the One World Order Global Government. Be attentive to any updates you see, react immediately to any announcements immediately. Your great dictator and global leader, Barack Hussein Obama, demands it. Remember always his directive. Submission is adherence to authority. Enslavement is freedom from worry or coherence to euthanasia. Use your right for complacency as needed, smoke your weed and relax. It is an order from your global leader, Barack Hussein Obama. Do your duty each day, turn in your family or friend if you see subversive attitudes or if you hear them speak in an unloyal way about our global world order. Compliance is conformity for the good of the global government. The following notice is being made to all global education districts. It has come to the attention of the magistrate office that the number of conformities to permissive clothing is up above the expected numbers for the month. All administrators are advised to take steps to conform your students to the required and permissible clothing shown here in this statement. Any student who does not conform is to be reconditioned immediately or corporal punishment be applied at once to maintain conformity in the classroom. This is an immediate stipulation. The following notice is being made to all global education districts. It has come to the attention of the magistrate office that the number of conformities to permissive clothing is up above the expected numbers for the month. All administrators are advised to take steps to conform your students to the required and permissible clothing shown here in this statement. Any student who does not conform is to be reconditioned immediately or corporal punishment be applied at once to maintain conformity in the classroom. This is an immediate stipulation. The 
following notice is being made to all global education districts. It has come to the attention of the magistrate office that the number of conformities to permissive clothing is up above the expected numbers for the month. All administrators are advised to take steps to conform your students to the required and permissible clothing shown here in this statement. Any student who does not conform is to be reconditioned immediately or corporal punishment be applied at once to maintain conformity in the classroom. This is an immediate stipulation. And now your daily statics report. Consistent numbers show all are conforming to the global magistrate order for acceptance of the mandatory mark. Hourly reports show that predicted numbers of loyal citizens are accepting the mark without incident. No compliance officer has reported any subversive actions taken by most persons coming into this zone from the other two zones of the world. Some terminations are being reported above the expected number for the day, compared to the previous year reports. Submission to government operatives during routine interrogations and examinations of valid identification show no inherent change in public reactions to adherence of rule and conformity. Statistical evaluation shows all are normal for expected results for this day compared to last year. Our great leader is expected to make his evening statement tonight to give his own impression of how the world order continues to expand our presence in areas that were thought beyond control. Please keep watching for additional information throughout the day and evening on this global news network global world order broadcast station or outlet. Continue using your euthanasia inhibitors when needed. This is GNN, the global news network of the One World Order Global Government. Serving Zone 6 in English, the official language of the Azone continent. Be watching for additional information, if authorized by your compliance officer or during times of allowed periods between work times.